hello, hello. Hi, everybody. So, uh, it's a little late today because I woke up like right at two o'clock. <laughs> Whoops. I looked at the clock after I woke up and I was like, oh, uh oh. <laughs> Rip. Yeah, good morning. <laughs> Might as well be, because I just woke up. Evil, how are you? I was just like, oh fuck. <laughs> what are we doing? Oh god. Now that I'm like thoroughly all over the Oh right. The fourth block. Um the katana. I need the katana from the fourth block. Just gonna try to get that tonight. Work is actually working you? Wow. How's Jamie? Oh, Jamie, I hope you're feeling a little better today. Please spread out and search the area. I just found something. I'll give it to you later. chance to like ceramic legs that's not what I was looking for. please spread out and search the area yes I think we can use this so bad oh And search the area. Not sure if I should wait for a floor that has like rare oh, stuff on it, or if I. Uh, just make everybody run around until we get it. But I think they can loot the rare chests. So I think I have to be the one that loots them. There are more enemies here than usual. That means there's the gold guys. Fuck. Well then. Fuck. Well, I had to scare one of them off because this fucker keeps trying to come over here. Excuse me. I have a feeling that death is near. Ah, fuck. Please spread out and search the area. Let's pick up the items, guys. If you get murdered, that ain't my fault. Please spread out and search the area. The stairs. Okay. out and search the area yes I found something valuable it's actually something valuable or boom we got it there's no access point on this fucking floor fuck off 
my foe. Oh, there it is. Excuse me, sir. Okay. Yeah, I did the thing. Got the katana. Katana must be the Mikazuki Chika. Chika? Hola, Chika. I heard that it's named for its resemblance to the crescent moon. And is capable of tempting one's heart. Indeed, this is a beautiful design as well. I feel like I can gaze at it forever. Thank you very much. Oh, I thought he was going to want one from like the fifth block, but I guess not. Well, <laughs> in that case, we're pretty good to go then, aren't we? We just need to pick up Empress and Aeon. Uh, and then we can drop out and we can do the fucking New Year's Eve event. Which decides what ending we're gonna get in this game. Oh fuck. Yes, lots of hugs for Jamie. Uh, back. Fucking maid outfit. Still the best armor that we have. The fucking maid outfit. bothering to check so hard at, um oh yeah wait omega drive increases chance of dealing critical hits interesting so that's what that does okay i thought it was something different want to ship 2700 it orders monday wow Jesus Christ. Armor has the Sigma Drive. That's what I was thinking of. I saw the Omega Drive I was thinking of. Okay. One last save? 
And then we can head out and do our, uh... I wish we, I wish there was still something to do here, but there really isn't. It's short of just grinding, which I don't feel like doing. Today is the last day of the second semester. Think about all that has happened. However, you must still go to school. Overhear a conversation. Morning! It's cold today, but it's worth it for winter vacation tomorrow. What are you getting with your New Year's gift? I haven't got ours yet. But I want to get a lucky bag. I'm aiming for that purse. Well, me too. Hey, did you want to start waiting in line today? We could bring a kotatsu. Wow, drinking my chocolate milk makes my VTuber like freak out. Oh wow. Um, good luck with that, I guess. <laughs> I'm sorry. Your break starts tomorrow. I'm sure most of you are just going to sleep in during New Year's. Yep. That's a mood. Better stop relying on your parents so much. And don't fall asleep in the kotatsu, okay? You can't tell me what to do! You're not my real mom! You know, kotatsu, I'm reminded of a passage from a famous novel. Shutter of the East Window. Wait, that was a futon. Right, that's enough out of you. A futon and a kotatsu are practically the same thing, wise guys. Having fun teasing your teacher? Look, all I'm saying is that if you're not careful when you sleep in a kotatsu, you could get burned, okay? <laughs> uh. Imagine just sitting there and making fun of your teacher. Your break begins tomorrow. Okay. Uh, Empress. We'll hang out with Mitsuru. Port Island Station movie theater. Watched a m we had a movie date with Mitsuru. I never imagined the popcorn you eat while viewing a movie movie could taste so good. All right. Popcorn while watching a movie is like the best kind of popcorn. If I knew it, I'd eaten your half too. I apologize. Oh, that's fine. I, that's I feel that. Watching movies on your own whim is so relaxing. You can have bored written all over your face without having to consider the feelings of others. Is it boring? Oh no, I was speaking hypothetically. I enjoyed it. Zuru is smiling. I don't think I would normally have this type of conversation. You're the type of girl who wouldn't feel uncomfortable watching a movie by herself, are you? Maybe more suited to ride a motorcycle than me. Motorcycle? Yes, I believe you've seen it before. I used to use it when I provided support for the team. However, I didn't purchase it solely for that purpose. Motorcycle, I can go where I want, when I want, all by myself. It's my modest attempt at rebelling against my restricted life. I had planned to get rid of it after it was damaged, but I decided to have it repaired instead. Maybe a bit of an exaggeration to say I cherish it. I do ride, ride, blah, uh, blah, blah, blah. But I do enjoy riding it when I have the time to. Through seems happy. Can I ride with you someday? Yes, I want to ride with Mitsuru on her motorcycle. Don't take that the wrong way. Two, with you, anywhere would be fun. Seems very happy. Thank you, I feel much better. Mitsuru has expressed her gratitude to you.
don't have any objections. I'd like to stay here with you for a little while longer. Second term has finally ended. There are only five days left until New Year's Eve. My fear and anxiety still remain. But I'm no longer confused. Fight to the end. Made up my mind. Yeah, everybody's like, we're gonna do it. We're gonna fight till the very end. We're not gonna forget about everything and just die. And you could totally turn around and be like, Okay, we'll forget about everything and just die. <laughs> the game is clearly guiding you in a certain direction. Let's walk the dog. Making you more than usual tonight. Okay, we'll go for a walk, buddy. Aw. Farmer is looking up at you. Has Coral Maru had been thinking about the days to come? Coral Maru's eyes are filled with a light of resolution. Aww. And Coral Maru has decided. Her vacation begins today. Sumi Port Island Station. Huh? Junpei-kun? Ah, uh, hey, Suku. What are you doing here? Nothing, really. I come here when I'm feeling down. Oh. Is that Chidori's sketchbook? Fuka points to the sketchbook Junpei is holding. Hmm? Oh, yeah. This is where I first met her. What are you doing here, Fuka? Oh, I went home for a bit. I've been going back there a lot lately. I see. You know, you've really changed, Suka. What about their what about the other party members' parents? Like Everybody is like, "Oh god, we're going to die." And there's only a couple of characters out of the team that are like, "Fuck, I should talk to my parents about this." Or not about not about this, but like I should go and be with my parents. But nobody else ever mentions them. Except for the people that don't have them. Like what about Junpei's parents? I don't think they're ever mentioned. Anyway. You are totally different from when you first came to the dorm. Really? Yeah, you were so timid back then, but now you're so strong. You've changed too, Junpei-kun. Yukatan said the same thing, but I don't think so. I mean, just the other day, I got all freaked out about being scared. Oh. I even lashed out at the leader. <laughs> I'm one piece of work, aren't I? <laughs> That's not true. But I really was scared. Actually, I'm still scared. I'm sure literally everybody else is too. But after thinking about it, I realized that I don't want to lose my memory. If I forget everything, that means I'll forget Chidori too. And I wouldn't even be alive right now if it wasn't for her, you know? So I say F that. <laughs> Let Junpei say fuck! <laughs> Let Junpei say fuck! <sighs> you're scared because you're not running away. That's nothing to be ashamed of. Fuka. That's why I want to protect everyone. Think about it. The dark hour is really scary too, isn't it? But our personas awaken, <laughs> and we're here today. Seriously, though. This is, that's like the only time in the game, I think, where there's even remotely 
the F word and they just are like, oh, F that instead of, oh, fuck that. It should have just been like, oh, fuck that. <laughs> the future hasn't been decided yet. And I want to be true to myself. True to yourself. Sorry, whenever my face freaks out, it's because I'm drinking my chocolate milk. Leave me alone. You're really something, Fuka. We should fight. I agree. Diamond! And five pearls! Oh yeah, we finished it. is pretty good. <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, uh, let's think about my grandfather and what he did. I get so angry. If it wasn't for him, everything would be okay right now. I know it's not good to dwell on the past, but The month is coming up. What we'll finally decide. Whatever it is, I hope we won't regret it. Christmas is over. All that's left now is New Year's Eve. Major decision? Yes. That's good. Alright, let's finish the sun social link. Oh, hi, Mom! Thank you for the sub eight months. Holy shit. Been streaming for that long. Oh god, I've been waiting. Finished my story and wanted to show it to you. Nari wears a calm smile. So you know, I was having a lot of trouble with the ending. I finally figured it out. The alligator ate his friend the bird! He cried and cried for a very long time. Oh. In fact, he was so sad that he drowned in his own tears! Oh god, this is so depressing. His tears became a beautiful lake. Around which grew beautiful flowers and a tree with delicious fruit. Oh. Their animals in the forest came here there often to relax. None of them knew the alligator had created it or that he was gone. The end. The ending undecided. That's all you've been doing? Don't you work today? Or was that not until like later? Well, the alligator did not find meaning in his life, the instance of the forest did. Oh, six, okay. Right, okay. Realize it, because the meaning of my life is not something I should worry about. It's really what others think of my life or what I was able to do for them. Oh god, mom, like, I woke up at two o'clock, I was like, oh fuck. <laughs> I'm tired. <laughs> oh, bird fact! Bird fact. Uh...
Okay, we all know that birds evolved from dinosaurs. Sh shush. Flamingos pair for a lifetime. Some stay with their mates for 50 years or more. Wow. They <laughs> do? Wow. solve for me or you or anyone meaning of our lives is something that we make but don't see people can't survive without help from others we all depend on one another okay have a good lurk I don't know if that made sense but do you kind of get what I'm saying sure I'm glad this is the notebook I wrote my story in all I have to leave behind I wanted you to have something, since you shared my last moments. In a worn notebook. Kanari stood up. My body feels lighter. Thank you for everything. Coming to see me, talking, even discussing the meaning of life. I... I can be glad that I was born. Understand Akinari's kindness. Sura, the ultimate form of the Sun Archon. The Grand Being. To go now. Nako. Maybe. Someday. Hope. We meet again. Kanari disappeared into the afternoon sunlight. He gripped his notebook tightly and decided to head back to the dorm. Hi, how was your day? Four more days until New Year's Eve. Thinking about what I'm going to do on the 31st. I was afraid I might go crazy from fear. But I was wrong. I feel strong. Because everyone is with me. Chidori gave me her life. I won't forget that. I'd rather die than forget. Read in a book that fear is an emotion we learn to keep us away from danger. I don't think that you can truly live if you're always running away from danger because you're afraid. Facing our fears, we feel alive. So I... So you what? Schoolmates are probably all enjoying their vacation. They're probably sitting by the fire, drinking hot chocolate. Wish we could do that. Junpei can go with us tonight. Walk the dog. Woof, woof, woof. Oh, it's freezing out here. Hey, Coral Maru, let me borrow your fur. You already made your decision, right? Yeah, I made mine too. Just wanted to let you know. Oh, I saw Fuka today. She's pretty tough. She wasn't like that before, but she's gotten way stronger. Talking to her was like that last little shove I needed. Girls are tough, and that's no joke! Spoke with Junpei for a while. Woof! Seems Koromaru is done playing. <laughs> are you saying me too? Don't worry, dude. Everyone knows what a tough doggy you are. He's <laughs> the toughest doggy. Who's the toughest doggy you are?
winter vacation continues. A month is coming up. Oh, final. Oh, yeah, okay. Alright. We have free time, so... Oh, right, the... I, I keep forgetting to pick up the rewards from the missing people. <laughs> We should so. Play. Uh, there, we have uh, some. We have some coins. valuable stuff also be sold and then suddenly we have five million yet one to all stats. Interesting. Armor made from demon's hide. Made fiery made ice. Okay. Only because that bow was a massive upgrade. Absolutely massive. Ooh, yeah, the autumn forest. Autumn forest is pretty. Yeah, you're not gonna have anything new until after New Year's. I don't know why I bothered checking. Hi, how was your day? Three more days until New Year's Eve. Decided what you're going to say to Ryoshi kun Sure have. I mean, he's gonna try to change our minds, but we ain't gonna have it. Okay. Let's walk at the doggy. Thanks for the energy drink, Koro Maru. <laughs> Winter vacation continues. The box in the room, it's a delivery order TV show, yay! Today 
would have been the day that we would have gone to Tartarus if I hadn't gone on uh, on Christmas. By the way, I never checked the antique shop. Is there anything I feel like Armageddon is how you cheese the Reaper, but I don't actually know that for sure. Oh, I see it. It shows you what you get. For fusing a persona with a weapon. Oh. The, uh, wow. I forgot. I can check and see what the ultimate weapons are for everybody, but I don't. Persona. The ultimate weapon. Let's see. Ultimate weapon for each character. Oh my god, internet, please. Okay. Female MC, Kurt Takia, Shiva, Shiva. But it doesn't say what to fuse them with, like, you're not helping me. Uh. Wow, 450 attack, 100 accuracy, plus 10 to all stats, that's, that's just about everybody's ultimate weapon. Interesting. We don't have any of these personas yet, though. But they look like they're some for uh, Asura. Like, we just got the ability to fuse Asura, so. It looks like they are personas from maxing out social links. We'll have to keep that in mind if we decide that we want to do that. But if we decide that we want to make ultimate weapons, we would have to go back to Tartarus and pick up some more blank weapons, which I don't really want to do. I think we'll be fine without them. Okay, he's almost here. Made up my mind. Fight with all I've got. I know we're gonna win. I got so confused thinking about it, but then I figured it out. Whatever Nyx is, all you have to do is kill it. <laughs> You're gonna kill death itself. Because that's how that works. Ah! Hello? Are you awake? Well, now I am, Yukari. Fucking thanks. I'm up. Hey, I have good news. I guess is coming back today. 
Oh, I guess it's kind Mitsuru Senpai said her wounds have finally healed. We're meeting in the lounge tonight. Don't forget, okay? See ya! Okay, I guess is alive! I mean, she is like a robot, so you could just like repair her if she gets fucked up. Hikari has left. You, my face freaks out when I drink chocolate milk. <sighs> Just let me drink my <laughs> chocolate milk in peace, please. Me <laughs> alone. It's perfectly normal. Not possessed at all. <laughs> Dormitory Lounge. Oh, is that the name of the server? Or is that like the official name? Hi, Gomi! <laughs> you game too hard! Everyone is gathered around Igus, who has finally returned. I'm back, everyone. Sorry to have worried you all. Man, I'm glad to see you. I was getting nervous. Me too. I was fearing the worst. I'm a machine, so I can always be rebuilt. <laughs> Didn't I just say that? I was like, oh, if she gets fucked Even up, she can just be revealed. completely destroyed, the programming data necessary to recreate me would still exist. Hey, don't talk about yourself like that. They said another week would be required for a complete recovery, but I had the process expedited. Tomorrow is New Year's Eve. I'm sorry for all the trouble I've caused. Oh. Mitsuru-san visited me at the lab and told me everything. That must have been difficult for you all to hear. Have you been well? I mean, considering the circumstances. Aww. Welcome back! <laughs> I've... Dodged back, the question. But... <laughs> Ten years ago, I... What I did to you was... <sighs> Don't worry about it. But... If I hadn't done that to you, you wouldn't be suffering like this. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Ryoji has presented you with a difficult choice. Have you made your decision? Yep. I have a favor to ask of you. Tomorrow, when Ryoji comes, please, please kill him. No! If we do that, we'll get the bad ending! I guess, no! I can't bear to see everyone hurting like this. Oh shit, is that today? Fuck. It's my phone. I'm very, I'm very bad at keeping track of birthdays. Happy birthday, noob. There. Please choose to have your memories erased. Oh, if we do that, we'll get the bad ending. Even if... Even if it means forgetting everything. And everyone. I guess, what are you talking about? 
Everybody's already decided that we're gonna all fight to the end, and I guess comes in and it's just like, no. Yeah, this isn't like you. What's wrong, I guess? Why? Why did I come back here? My mission is to protect humanity from shadows. But now I know that I can't defeat them. So then, why am I here? I'm useless. I cannot even shed a tear for you all. Oh, I guess. Why fight when you know that you can't win? What is the purpose of that? Why are you wasting your lives? Have to try. Yeah, she's right. We have no intentions of wasting our lives. That's why we want to see what's waiting for us up ahead. Right, Ken? Right. I... I don't understand. It must be because I don't possess a life. <laughs> this has nothing to do with having a life. <laughs> Who has a life anyway, am I right? <laughs> I'm a machine. A machine that was created to protect humans from shadows. But I can't fulfill that mission with the powers I was given. So then, what is my purpose now? Could someone please tell me? We don't know the answer, I guess. The only one who can tell you what your purpose is, is you. That's why we're having such a hard time making our decision. There's just no easy answer. But as long as we're alive, we have to do something. When we see others hurting, we want to help them. So that's our purpose. <laughs> I'm not too good at explaining it, but that's what we all think. Can finding one's purpose really be so simple? When I saw you collapse, I realized something. I want to protect you. I don't want to forget about you. Buka-san. There are times when you will lose sight of your goal, and you will have to search for it. But if you can't find it again, then you must set your heart on a new goal. <laughs> It's just casually doing some sit-ups, you know, no big deal. <laughs> I'm not really one to talk, but I feel that I've come to understand something important this year. Okay, I'm done with the chocolate milk, so I won't my face shouldn't freak out anymore. To truly live, you will need to make changes sometimes. Do you think I can do that? Do you think I can change? Yes. I mean, you've changed so much already. Haven't you noticed? In fact, you're changing even as we speak. I know what my purpose is. I'm a machine. A machine who is here to live. And the one who has given me this new purpose is... me. This is the promise I've made to myself. I don't know how I'll do it, but I guess that is part of living, too. It's for you to decide. Yes. I guess nodded reassuringly. Resolution and I guess his heart has awakened a new persona. Palladian has given rise to Athena. Will you allow me to join with you all? You're already part of us. Thank you. I will be with you all. No matter what happens. That's the spirit. Now I know why I'm here. Destination lies in the decision we make. Let's choose wisely. No 
No, she was purposefully made with the ability to have, to be able to have a persona. She's a, a shadow destroying weapon, so she has to have a persona to be able to destroy shadows. I don't think it's explained in this game exactly how that works. Like how she, uh, how the, the, um, like, machines, <laughs> what is your purpose? You have trauma. Oh my god. <laughs> Uh, the house closed. They now have two weeks to move. How much do you want to bet that they are totally not ready at all in the least bit? Not packed or anything? How are so many gems and energy drinks and bombs of life hidden in this park. Today's New Year's Eve. And yes, somehow we have free time during the day. Thinking about this for a long time. Day is finally here. I know my answer sure of my answer. No, she's not here yet? Dude, where the hell is he? He's not gonna pop up until like midnight or something. I know why I'm here. Destination lies in the... Okay. Today's the day. Like I'm stepping into the ring. Like I said, I'm not gonna bother showing the bad ending because... All it is, is literally just everybody forgets everything and then it just kind of skips to the end. And then kind of abruptly ends. The end of the game? No, not quite. We still have another month. After we make our dec- Like, if we made the decision to kill Ryoji, then it would be the end of the game and we get the bad ending. But if we make the decision to not kill him, we still have another month until January 31st would be the end. Obviously, we're not going to pick the bad ending. Promise, Ryoshi has finally come. The moment has arrived for you to make your decision. Hey, long time no see. <laughs> not named after you. Not everything is about you. Midnight's just around the corner. At midnight, I will change from this form into something unrecognizable. Unrecognizable? Uh, whatever. So, have you reached a decision? Everyone is silent. Okay. I'll be waiting in her room until midnight. Oh, you're just gonna fucking take up residence in my room? You have your answer. Sure. Ryoji kun. Oh, and one more thing. Don't let the fact that you'll have to kill me influence your decision. As I said before, I'm oh. going to disappear anyways. Call Ryoji that. He's a baby. I won't feel any pain by dying. So there's no need to worry about me. Ryoji's my favorite, okay? Don't insult him. I'll be waiting. Ryoji went upstairs. Have you made your decision? Yep. I see. Have the rest of you made your decision? No need to ask me. 
You know how I feel. I wouldn't be here if I wasn't on board. Yo, oh, she is Babby. Yes. Yes. I am too. Perf. I have made my decision as well. Then we're all in agreement, yes? Better let him know then. Okay? Excuse me, Ken is a literal child, like an elementary school kid. Oh, she's standing in a corner. Hey. I didn't think I'd ever be in this room under circumstances like these. I had a good time, you know, back then. Okay, but then how do you explain Ken from Street Fighter? Did you forget that he exists? Don't tell me you've all decided to let me live. We did. That's the decision. The decision is final. Ken was American? Oh. Okay. Maybe maybe they maybe they just decided to name their kid after <laughs> After Ken from Street Fighter. <laughs> <laughs> You're all going to risk your lives on a battle you can't win. But you're the only one here right now, so... I'll say this one more time. If you kill me, Tartarus, the Dark Hour, and your memories of the battles will all disappear. Tomorrow, you'll wake up a normal high school student. You'll be able to live in peace until the moment of the fall. But if you let me live, you'll spend every waking moment until that day in fear of your inevitable death. Nyx cannot be defeated. It's useless to fight her. Are you still thinking? <laughs> no, I stopped thinking a while ago. <laughs> or have you already made up your mind? This is a very important decision. You must choose wisely. And there it is. The decision that gives you the, the bad ending or the good ending. Obviously, we're gonna kill- no. <laughs> we're letting him live. I guess my words didn't change your mind. There's still some time until midnight. I didn't want to have to show you this, but I have no choice. Yeah, he's going to try to change our minds. By showing us his true form. See? I'm not human. I will bring death to this world until I am finally satiated. Do not hesitate to kill me. I want you to think about this carefully. Is facing Nyx really the best decision? Yes. Some things in this world cannot be changed. You do not understand this yet. <laughs> Jamie! Memories are ambiguous. Old ones can be replaced with new ones, creating a new reality. <laughs> I love how this is like the most serious part of the game, like we're making a very serious decision and we can't take anything seriously right now. Don't you want to end all your friends' pain and suffering? Uh. It's up to you. You are the only one who can make this decision. Now, this is your last chance. Tell me your answer. Please, kill me. I don't want you to suffer. I know you don't want us to suffer, but we're not killing you. <sighs> I understand. It's regrettable, but it's your life. You can do what you want with it. I will respect your decision.
Let's go back to the lounge. I need to tell you guys how to confront Nyx. Well, at least he's gonna tell us how to confront Nyx and not just like fucking leave. Oh, I should say my farewell to you, shouldn't I? This is the last time we'll be able to speak like this. Thank you. Goodbye. And I'm sorry. I wish we could have had more time together. It was nice. I'm oh, glad we met. Maybe. I'm glad I knew you as Ryoji Mochizuki. I'm glad we could share these last few moments together like this. Thank you. Yo, know, she is smiling. Yo, know, she slipped off a ring that was on his finger. Could you hold on to this? It's proof that I was human for however short a time. If you held on to it for me, I. I think I'll be able to stand it. <laughs> Let's get married, Ryoji! <laughs> Received a faint glow ring from Ryoji. A strong, solid bond with Ryoji. Stow upon thee to the ability to create Norn, the ultimate form of the fortune arcana. Oh! The three goddesses of fate. <laughs> you got yours for the day. You sure fucking did. I love you. Oh, Ryoshi, baby. Oh. Love you too, buddy. We should go back. The others will be worried, I'm sure. So sad. Return to the lounge. Your friends rush towards you, relieved. Yo, what's up, Ryoji? <sighs> it's an unfortunate decision, but it is yours to make. That's right. But you can't defeat Nyx. It's impossible. We can sure as hell fucking try. But we must still try. Personally, I don't care if it is impossible. I understand. It's almost midnight, so I'll keep this brief. I'll tell you where to find Nyx. You'll find her at the top of Tartarus. On the promised day, you must journey to the top of the tower. When's the promised day? January 31st. Exactly one month from tomorrow. January 31st, 2010. Nyx will descend to Tartarus. And the world will end. One month. Tartarus is a gigantic rift in the darkness of the night sky. It's a beacon to guide Nyx. With the apprisers coming, Nyx learns that the way has been prepared and descends there. And thus, the demise will come. Fucking Streamlabs froze again. Oh, there it goes. So that's why it's called the Tower of Demise. But what you're saying is, we can fight Nyx if we reach the top? That's right. Yep. But remember, from today you will fight against eternal despair. Like I've said so many times before, Nyx cannot be defeated. Well, if we can't kill Nyx, we can certainly do something else to prevent Nyx from causing the end of the world. You ever thought about them apples? When you face her, you will finally understand this truth. And then you will realize what it is you are trying to stand against. We understand. 
There's no need to keep telling us. January 31st. We won't forget that date. I've already forgotten that date. Well, I'll be going on ahead of you then. I want to leave you while I'm still in this form. Ryoji-kun. I guess I'm sorry for all the pain and suffering I put you through. I won't forget that you were my enemy and my friend. I guess. Thank you. This will probably be the last time I'll see you all like this. You think you think this is going to be the last time you're going to see us? But I'll always be watching over you. <laughs> I'm not going to say any more than that, you know. Well, goodbye. <sighs> goodbye. My dearest. Best wishes in the coming year. That's what you say on New Year's Eve, right? See ya. See ya on January 31st. No, she left. <laughs> that Ryoji. We have one month until January 31st. Together, we'll reach the top. Made an important decision with everyone. Feel a strong bond with your friends. Susano O. Raging God. We big fools now, absolutely. Made an important decision with your comrades. Comrade! Relationship with them has grown stronger and reached a new level of closeness. Judgment. Establish the Nyx Annihilation Team social link of the Judgment Arcana. New Year is about to begin. One month on January 31st. You will be able to face Nyx. You must reach the top of Tartarus by that day. This is the decision you have all made. 2009 is quietly drawing to a close. It's a year filled with many memories. Hello! Are you up? Morning. Oh, wait, I mean, Happy New Year's. Hey, you want to come to the shrine with us? The shrine? Mitsuru Senpai prepared kimonos for us. Kimonos? Fuck yeah. Let's go. <laughs> then let's go get dressed. Come on, the kimonos are in my room. Seems you'll be going to the shrine with Yukari and the others. A while later, in the dormitory lounge, Ken came downstairs just as Akihiko was feeding Koromaru. Good morning. Oh, um, Happy New Year, Senpai. Happy New Year's to you, too. Yeah. Happy New Year to you, too, Koro. Oh man, I completely overslept. Why'd I stay up all night watching that stupid movie? <laughs> God, June pays a mood. <laughs> Did 
you guys see it? It had these giant Amazon women running wow, around. Wow, no wonder he was watching it. <laughs> Why would I watch that? Um, is anyone going to visit the shrine? No, I don't believe in superstitions. Watching. <laughs> Me either. Oh, that's too bad. Yukari-san and the others are already there. They're all wearing kimonos. Kimonos, huh? Top. Oh. Uh, I'm gonna run to the store. <laughs> Hold it right there, Junpei. How fucking predictable can you be, Junpei? Uh, what? You're going to the shrine, aren't you? N no, I'm not. I'm. Uh, I'm just going for a walk. <laughs> I'm just uh, going for a walk. You know, no, no. Oh yeah. Well, I'm going with you then. I'm bored. Oh, I'll go too. <laughs> All right then, let's go. Anyone know where it is? Yeah, the girl told me the directions. Sweet. <laughs> Naganaki Shrine. Shrine is crowded with people visiting for New Year's. Have you decided what to wish for? But this year is great! <laughs> Me too. Then let's pray for that from the bottom of our hearts. They're so cute in their kimonos! Lined up with everyone and major wishes. There's nothing to worry about. I have the utmost certainty that we can do this. Yeah. Oh, it's Junpei-kun and the others. Just as Fuka mentioned, the guys came up the stairs and through the entrance. Happy New Year! Let's all do our very best this year! But man, you guys are late! Yukata! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> what? Happy New Year! Hmm? What's the matter, Yori? Mitsuo-senpai! You look hot. <laughs> Holy shit. Somebody punch Junpei, please. Stupe. I, um, I, I mean... Stop staring at me. Happy New Year's, everyone. I've never worn a kimono before. Um, does my sash look okay? Fuka, you look... Wow. Jeez. This traditional clothing is quite interesting. However, it's difficult to move in. Even Icus is wearing one. Hi, <laughs> uh, John. Considering what you usually wear, that looks even more amazing on you. Is that so? What is this odd sensation I feel? <laughs> but man, <laughs> I gotta say. Um, you look pretty cute yourself. Uh. <laughs> Kihiko! <laughs> oh, uh, it, it's <laughs> Wow! Ah, I'm so glad I came. <laughs> New Year's kicks ass! Yeah! Junpei-san, why are you acting so strange? <laughs> when is he not acting strange? Man, we got to see some great stuff today. Right, Akihiko-senpai? Uh, I, uh, I guess so. Hey, aren't you guys cold? Mm, a little, but I love this time of year. Um, that's not what I meant. Junpei-san said that you guys aren't wearing anything underneath your kimonos. <laughs> he said what? He said what? Huh? <laughs> wow, you've really taken Ken-kun under your wing, huh? Uh-oh. <laughs> uh, no, 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 wait, wait, wait. Ouch. <laughs> that stupid gets what he deserves. Oh, oh, we're in a, a 
cute little orange kimono. Little flowers on it. Pulled the fortune out, and it was worst luck. The hell of a way to start the new year. Don't you hate getting the worst luck, fortune? I feel like he's the reason my luck is so bad. Maybe I should break up with him? Oh. Takayaki. What, you think you'd get a discount just because it's New Year's? Just buy some, please. Sure. Why are they playing this song right now? Oh, God. Wearing this makes me feel renewed. Although the sash, sash makes it hard to breathe. You okay, Minako-chan? Want to leave? Stay a little longer. You know if you want to leave. Uh, well, um... I'm not used to seeing you wearing something like that. I'm kind of embarrassed, sorry. Dude, I didn't say that! D don't make things up! What? But you? <laughs> arf, arf! How could Stupe say such a thing to a kid? I can't believe him. You know, it's nice to do this sort of thing once in a while. Gotta make a fresh start and think positively. Do our best. Drew a paper fortune, and it read, Great luck, anticipating excellent results. Let's get going. Okay. Yeah, that's all there is. Just to talk with everybody. So, did you guys finish making your wishes? Of course we did. Oh, but I ain't telling what I wished for. You're just gonna get punched again if you say what you wished for, aren't you? I heard your wish won't come true if you tell anyone. Isn't that what they say about prophetic dreams? Uh, it's not like it takes a rocket scientist to figure out what Junpei wished for. <laughs> hey, wait, 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 what's up with that? Rip. What, you think it's gonna be something like, I wish to meet a hot babe, huh? Well, shows what you know. What I really wished for is... The same thing we all did, right? I wish to prevent the demise. Huh? Yeah. <laughs> Let's nip it in the bud. Mm-hmm. Besides, don't you go for younger girls anyway? Oh! What? Oh! Whoa, did I guess right? Creepy. <laughs> punch him again. Cell phone's ringing. Path that was blocked is now open. One more thing. I regret to inform you that my sister has expressed a desire to test you. If you are interested, please enter the door that has appeared at the entrance of Tartarus. You can reach my sister from there. Oh, wait. That opened up? I thought we needed to kill the Reaper to open that up. That's the optional dungeon. I thought... Holy shit. At least in the original game you had to kill the Reaper to open up the optional dungeon, but it looks like we just... It's just open. Well, okay. Not really expecting that. Happy that we were able to celebrate the new year, but this month is going to be very important. Make sure you spend your time wisely. Junpei is so... First day of the new year, after making our big decision, he... He's such a pervert. 
Never understood the significance of a new year. Never really meant that much to me. But with all that has happened, now I realize that it's a time to leave behind the past. Look forward to the future. Everything is possible in the new The year always brings new beginnings. Well, let's refresh our minds and do our best to defeat Nyx. I asked before, but is it true that? <laughs> oh my god! It's a secret! Is it really that big of a deal? If it's a secret, then you don't have to tell me. <laughs> wow. Just in time. You gotta tell me. Oh my god! Oh my god! I'm done talking to both of you. After all this happened, it's good to be starting a new year. You're beautiful, of course. Aww. Arf! He doesn't want to go for a walk tonight. Um. There's the quest to defeat the Reaper. Difficulty is the full five stars, if you're wondering. I guess if I do want to get things like, um, the ultimate weapons and stuff, we will have to visit Tartarus, like, prior to January 31st. Because the next time the Tartarus visit is in the walkthrough is the very final day, but we might visit before then. And kind of push towards the end. Let's see here. Uh, about, uh, let me check about missing people. Due date, January 30. There's going to be two missing people, so we should wait until they go missing before we go in to do the sixth block. Oh, wait, what? Heard that a cult held a meeting recently. Wonder how much that'll affect the city. I'm really worried. The mantra of this cult is, if you believe, you will be saved. Ridiculous, isn't it? We need to keep our guards up. The public seems to be fooled by these words. If you believe you'll be saved. What a joke. 
Who would buy that? Serious cult put posters up all over town. They haven't done anything since then. Not that that's a bad thing. It's just a little unnerving. I saw a news report about that cult. They've become so big so quickly. Weird, huh? Seen the headlines? You know, one saying mysterious cult in town and the end is near. How do people know this? Must be because of Nyx. How are people aware? <laughs> That's gotta be fucking those two assholes from Strega. Arf! Good input, Koromaru. Um, there's nothing for us to do. But yeah, I think we'll try to go into Tartarus before... Um, we'll get as far as we can in the sixth block before January 31st. Okay, let's go to Tartarus. Can't just sit around here and do nothing, you know? Not yet. At least not until those people go missing. <laughs> I'm not gonna wait all the way until the last day to go visit, to go to Tartarus. Like, fuck. Oh, you wanna go for a walk? Sorry, wait. I need to take a quick break first. I will be our bye. Ugh. Yeah, I'll be RB.
Okay. Back. Oh, dog walk, right. Eesh. Winter vacation won't go on forever. It'll end pretty soon here, actually. Uh, yeah. I caught sight of the newspaper. I was sitting on the kitchen table. And so one of, one of our roads nearby is being widened because a lot of traffic. And they were thinking of putting a sidewalk down. And all the residents are just like, no, no sidewalk. Because, because the road's already being widened, so it's cutting into our property. And if you put down a sidewalk, it'll just cut into our property more. And then we have to be responsible for shoveling it. I mean, who cares about the safety of the people that want to walk to the park? I just don't want to have to shovel the sidewalk. And I'm just sitting here, I'm just standing there reading the, the article like, oh my god, these people. More salvation badges. So I also provide a set of four disaster-proof backpacks. Wait, what? No! Wait! Wait a minute! Bro! Isn't that a- is it a salvation badge an item? Or... No, it's not. I thought it was. <laughs> I was about to get real upset. Fucking hell! <laughs> No, it's not an item. I was about to get really mad. <laughs> Being like, are you fucking kidding me? Set of four for like the entire t team. I don't know, those items aren't actually anything. It's just nothing. Good, because if they were something, I was going to be so pissed. Okay, we're still going on about the new cult stuff. Apparently somehow everybody just believes that it's gonna be the end of the world or something. I don't know where they got that idea from. Uh, there's nothing to do. Unless, like, oh. You know. I don't think there's going to be any new requests. There definitely is not going to be any requests to get something from somebody. Yeah, okay. Sup, dude? Sup, dude? Free time, free time, free time, free time! Oh yeah, let's check. Uh, how's Tartarus? Nothing. Okay, gotcha.
But her vacation will be over soon. Hi, it's me. Have time to talk? Yep. Would you like to do something today? Yep. Excellent. She'll be waiting outside. Mitsuru seems excited. Let's go on a date with Mitsuru! Colonia Mall. Power Records. Having a good time hanging out with Mitsuru. I'm pleased that the classical music section has so many selections to choose from. Didn't expect this store to be so well stocked. Mitsuru seems to be enjoying her day off. I had no idea there were so many new artists. It seems that most music today is contemporary. But with so many different artists and styles of music, how do people choose their favorite? Mitsuru is impressed. You enjoy classical music, Arasato? So, I have some records in my room. Who even listens to records anymore? <laughs> yeah, seriously? Records? Seriously? I'd love to hear them. See, then I'll select a few for you. I hope they'll be to your liking. Saru seems to be having fun. Friendship seems to be getting stronger. Should we give her a present? I think we should. What's antique? What does that mean? Oh god, no. Let's give her some sugar cookies to make this. Delicious. Flavor simple yet warm, just like its creator. Thank you for giving this to me. Suru seems to really like your present. Oh, hey! Notice those weird symbols and posters all over town? They really creep me out. Nyx must be affecting everyone's mind. We should go to Tartarus. Month's gonna totally fly by, you know? Go to Tartarus! We have more important things to do! Like walking the dog! Hi, how was your day? We did literally nothing. That's, that's how our, our day was. School is starting again. I wonder how everyone's doing. Probably the same. It's true. Vacation wasn't long enough for anyone to change. Cases of apathy syndrome are on the rise again. There have been a lot of people reported missing as well. This is not good. Society is crumbling before our eyes. Everyone's so interested in the cult. There are news reports on it every single day. He's sick. I hope our school won't be like that. Be okay. Hope so. Using the clock to recover won't cost as much today. Well, I don't really care about that. I care about if Tartarus is unstable or not. Cult members talk about salvation and deliverance. People have different ways they want to be saved. Other people want money, others want peace. Or what the cult members want. Poor Omaru san has very good eyes. We'll need those eyes to see through the lies of that cult. I believe you'll be saved. I wonder if anyone actually thinks that's true. Kinda reminds me of those advertisements on the back of a magazine. You know, the ones that say, buy this product and you'll be happier. 
you know, whatever occurs during the dark hour is acknowledged differently by the public. It includes attacks by shadows. So if a person is found injured, the attack is usually blamed on a robber. If someone disappears, it's considered a kidnapping or an abduction. These incidents are sporadic and are classified as mysterious cases because everything about them is unexplainable. But now the number of incidents are increasing so fast that they're drawing the public's attention. Oh, that would explain why a cult suddenly sprang up. The number of incidents suddenly shot up. Then people would probably start thinking, oh fuck, it's the end of the world. There's like literally nothing for us to really do. <laughs> Welcome back. We should go to Tartarus tonight. Our goal now is to reach the top of Tartarus. We cannot falter. We'll do all that we can. Tartarus is unstable today. Okay. Oh. We're still not going. There's gonna be some people that'll go missing. <clears throat> and I wanna wait for them to go missing before we go into Tartarus. Well, hopefully Tartarus will be unstable after the people go missing. Alright. Last day of winter vacation. I really don't think we're gonna get anything. As far as requests go, I think we did so well on requests, and yeah. That's just gonna be Tartarus and Persona Fusion related stuff left. can go with you tonight. Woof! 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 Ah, Armor sound looks very happy. School will start again tomorrow. I'm actually looking forward to it. Everything seems so different. You wouldn't mind. Perhaps we could walk home together after classes tomorrow? I'd like to see the town with you, Minako-san with I guess for a while. Woof! Seems Coral Brew is done playing. Welcome back. Hmm? You're hungry. Well, we'll give you a small snack when we return. Just a little one, okay? Back to school time. The any of the third semester. Wait, third? Oh, okay. Overhear a conversation. Hey, have you heard of this cult? Hey, don't call it that if you don't know anything about it. The fall is coming, it's already decided. Oh, well if it's already decided, then it can't be helped. By the way, about the homework for second period? Oh, the end of the world's happening? Uh, you know, homework is more important. New Year, everyone. Winter break is over now. 
No more booze. Oh, you guys are underage. Wow, I feel sorry for you. Well, let's get right down to business. New year, so we'll start with the basics. Simple concept, but students often get it wrong. Talking about the apostrophe. Okay, Monaco. The free f three phrases I've written on the blackboard tell me which one is correct. It's wrong. It's absolutely right. It's is a contraction of it is. It's is a possessive word. Say it's tail or it's temperature, but not is wrong. There's another pair of words that are commonly confused. There and there have the same pronunciation, but they're not interchangeable, so watch out. Now, open your textbooks. Hey, uh, you busy? Junpei came over to talk to you. Could you come with me for a sec? Uh, okay. Sweet, thanks. <sighs> it's a nice day out. Why don't we go up to the roof? Oh. You're alone with Junpei. Oh. It's almost coming of age day, you know? I used to just think of it as a day off. But now, I wonder if I'm even gonna live long enough to celebrate it. Hope that you will. Yeah. It's been pretty weird around here lately. People have been passing out. Others have gone missing. Dude, it's crazy. Senpai said it's because there are too many shadow victims and the memory revision can't keep up. It's all gotta be because of this Nix. <sighs> oh, and have you heard about that doomsday cult? They've been running around town telling everyone they see that the end of the world is coming. Yeah, <laughs> sounds pretty typical. And we need to do something, and quick. We're on the case. Yeah. But it's not just Nix, you know. Two members of Strega are still alive. Yeah, they're hanging out in Tartarus waiting for us. They haven't done anything yet, but I know they've got to be planning something. And we need to take care of them, too. Man, to think I'd end up trusting such a cutie with my life. Wow. <laughs> I never would have imagined that happening last spring. <laughs> but then again, I never thought it would come to this. Junpei's looking far off into the distance. You know, I don't think it's completely hit me yet. It's just all so hard to believe. But that doesn't mean we should just sit around and wait for it to happen. You're pretty cool, man. That thing was inside you for ten years. And you harnessed its power and made it your own. Chunpei turned to face you. I know I've run my mouth a lot since the day we met. And yeah, maybe I called you cutie a couple of times, and you might have thought I was making fun of you. Do you aren't? But I'm totally serious when I tell you. I trust you with my life. I'm... I'm glad to know you. Oh. It's embarrassing to say it, but... But that's really how I feel. We'll always be friends, right? I mean, even after this is all over? Of course. <laughs> I'm gonna hold you to that, okay? You exchanged a firm handshake with Junpei. All right. Nako-san. It's been a long time since I first came to school. My outlook on many things has changed. I'm not sure these changes are for the best. Nako-san, do you have any plans after school lets out? It's all right with you. I'd like to walk home with you. Glad to hear that. There's one place I would like to visit before returning to the dorm. Shall we go? Naganaki Shrine.
I'm here a lot lately. Before, I couldn't understand the benefits of coming to these places called shrines. But lately, that has changed. It's also where we met Coral Maru-san last summer. He waited here until he found him, though he knew his master had died. Now I can understand his reasons for doing that. What drives people isn't necessarily facts, but feelings. He knew for a fact that his master had died, his feelings of wanting to be with him made him stay. Same for me. I have grasped the fact that I can't protect you, yet here I remain. Consciously, it's following my feelings rather than the available data. I was so confused at the time that I didn't notice it, but to tell the truth, it seems that the reasons behind my behavior changing while I'm with you, Mana. I a bond forming between you and Aegis, who has become more human. Establish the Igus social link of the Aeon Arcana. Seems that this is a <coughs> a new Arcana. Aeon social link. Oh, I have a correction to make. I talked about what drives people, but of course, Coral Marusan and myself aren't people. I'm sorry. This looks somewhat lonely. Decided to go back to the day. Where have you been? This term seems like any other term. I care about what's going to happen to the world. All I'm going to do is keep moving forward. Let me know when you want to go to Tartarus. Tartarus is unstable. We expected the cult has made its way into our school. Some people are fully devoted to it. We have to do something about Nyx. Someone at school thinks this is just a normal third term. No clue that this may be the last third term ever. Isn't it weird that we're the only ones who know about this? I expect that cult to become so popular. I thought more people would oppose it. Like a fire drawing moths to its flames. To think that our school would be safe from that cult, I was wrong. All our classmates are talking about the end of the world now. I have no idea what's really going on. I knew the cult would have some influence over the school, but I never imagined it would be to this extent. Think of any effective ways to counter them. Ah. Uh, I don't think there's anything we can really do aside from, like, saving the world? <laughs> I don't think there's anything we can do. Right. We have to defeat Nyx to break the control the cult has over everyone. Exactly. Alone from 10 to midnight because somebody called in? What the fuck? Oh no. Suddenly you're sick and your stomach hates you and you can't even move from the bed. <laughs> Teacher was talking about the cult during class the other day. I wouldn't say that Jewel's, like, sketchy, but... Yeah, there you go. We l Both Mom and I live in a relatively safe area. But, uh, yeah.
I mean, I have full confidence my mom could kick anybody's ass. <laughs> a good manager? What's a good manager? What are those? She wasn't trying to convince us to join it, though. But I heard that a lot of teachers at the high school are trying to convince their students. Why would you try to convince your students to join a cult? What the fuck? These teachers need their asses fired. Oh yeah, Fo, you are a manager now, aren't you? I'm sure you're like, al you're already uh, so much better than any other manager ever. Do that, and then they'll never leave you alone to close ever again. Okay, sorry, I guess we're not gonna hang out with you today. We're gonna hang out with Mitsuru. That's good. I'm sure you'll be great. <laughs> Gecko Khan High School Library. I need Mitsuru to the library to help her with her research. Mitsuru's looking at the bookshelf. Looking for something? No, I'm not. Thank you, though. I'm sure you would, Fo. Fo, you would be better than all of the managers at the jewel combined. No, you would. Saru seems to be pondering something. Looking through the literature section made me realize something. There are a lot fewer books about marriage and family life than there are romance novels. You think that means the most exciting time in one's life is before marriage? Is marriage worth that sacrifice? Saru seems melancholy. Well, to be frank, the group is in turmoil over the inheritance issue. To be honest, I'm having difficulty understanding the expectations of the other members. But I'm the daughter of the head of the group, expected to lead the company. And if that requires me to sacrifice something to do it. Oh, foe, you have no idea how horribly managed that jewel is and how horribly people are scheduled fiance has been chosen the new president of one of our affiliates what a place to stay in business barely they barely do much older than me. If I agree to the marriage, the future of a company will be secured. I was planning to announce the partnership and our engagement at the same time. Doing so will give the appearance that the company is stabilizing. The best solution for everyone involved. You're kidding, right? All true. It's all real. It's been cited for a long time. But it's going to take place sooner than originally planned. Personally, I'm fine with it. Contrary to her words, Mitsuru looks glum. Her parents chose the same path. So I won't run from my destiny. I think it's okay to run 
responsible. I'm sorry. I was the big one who began this conversation. What good will running away do? Leave everything behind and go on a journey of self-discovery? Wherever I run, the road will lead to regret. Saru forced a smile. Saru has confided something in you with something important to her. Arisato? Why was I born a woman? Put forth many times more effort than others so that no one could look down on me because of my sex. And yet, what has that brought me? In the end, I cannot escape from the fact that I'm a woman. Marriage to a near complete stranger, having my name and group stripped from me, expected to conceive an heir. Through marriage, the Kirijo group will prosper. Because I'm a woman. There in there, however, I need it. I apologize. It's not something I should be burdening you with. You too work hard as our leader. He's the one who chose you. Perhaps I forced the position on you. So that you could prove to me that there is no difference between men or women. Excuse me. I'm leaving now. Just because she's a woman, she can't, like, take over the company herself. Which is total bullshit. And she should take over the company anyway, regardless. Three more weeks till X day. It's weird. I was pissing my pants all last month. But since I decided that I was gonna fight, I'm not scared anymore. Let's go to Tartarus, man. We gotta do what we can do, right? Not yet. We're not going to Tartarus yet. Well, it seems like Tartarus is going to be unstable all month. Which is good. It means we can go there anytime. She should kill everyone and take it over! No! I mean, she could. I think she would succeed. But first, we gotta take the doggy for a walk. Very important. Maybe you'll get a fever while you're in the shower and you won't be able to go into work. Damn it, he's not gonna sell anything, is he? Fucking bitch. I guess I guess that one that one thing we bought was the last thing to buy. That sucks. I think he's just gonna sell the salvation stuff for the rest of the month. Uh, and I'll s yeah, okay, we really aren't gonna have anything new until... Whatever. Uh... Oh, hey! Oh, hey! Stop, hey! Oh, Tartarus is not unstable tonight. Today is coming of age day. There's no school. Okay. Hello. Today is coming of age day. I want my life to end before I become an adult. Go to Tartarus tonight. I want to see the world end. 
Everyone's like, let's go to Tartarus, let's go to Tartarus. And it's like, I don't even see Fuka here. Oh, there she is. Oh, whoa, 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 I just missed a whole conversation. About the cults. I wonder how many people truly believe in it. Seems much of the public is openly saying that the end of the world is coming. Yeah, even people I know. Most of them got interested through friends. Some people talking the other day, too. Saying that every day is so boring, the end of the world wouldn't be so bad. In other words, this cult is kind of like shopping. Helps people fill the emptiness they feel inside. Cults influence has spread across the city and even into our school. Everyone's talking about how the world is going to end as if it's fact. And why are people so weak? Everyone can be like us. Like robots, humans are all unique. Some people never give up, while others submit immediately. Who's the dumbass in charge of that cult? We are busting our asses and they go and pull this crap. You can't just blame the cult. Cult exists only because there are people willing to believe in it. I guess that's true. You have to do something. Believing or not believing in the cult is a personal decision. Myself, I would never believe in it. I think of my friendship with, friendship with Natsuki chan. I have no need to join the cult. On to friendship. Sounds like a fairy tale. I believe it is what all humans seek. Three. Most important thing is the connection two people share. That's right. No one can survive alone. Nietzsche was talking about the cult during class the other day. Oh, yeah, okay. Oh, somebody wants to go for a walk! Overhear a conversation. Lately, even the late night comedy shows have been talking about the end of the world. It feels creepy. Are you still talking about that? By the way, I wanted to show you this magazine that hit the stands today. Magazine? Don't tell me it's about cults. Well, just read it for yourself. You'll see how true it really is. Spend time with Mitsuru. Old. Should have my skin plated. I'd shine as bright as the sun. You all know what plating is, right? The process to cover objects in a thin metallic layer. Tin plating is done by plating iron with tin. For corrugated, galvanized iron, you plate iron with zinc. Gold metals, by the way, are created by plating silver with gold. So, technically, Olympic athletes don't win gold medals. Kinda sad. The sky is beautiful these days, because the air is clear. Stars produce light via nuclear fusion. Visible planets reflect the star's light. Not to say that one's superior to the other. Both have their own purposes. Life is the same way, though. It'd be hard for you kids to understand that now, you kids! news that's going around now? Media makes it sound supernatural. Don't listen to them. Kinda rumor spreads every now and then. Drop a die on a specimen. It'll die down soon. There's always fucking end of the world shit going on. Like, remember 2012? 
When everyone thought the world was going to end just because the Mayan calendar ended on that day or whatever. Something dumb like that. Ima Todai Strip Mall, Wild Duck Burger. I think I've acquired a taste for fast food. I'm so paranoid then? Oh man. I'll be honest, like with all the talk about it, I was kind of nervous too. But at the same time, <laughs> I just slept through that day and was like, yeah, okay. World's not ended, we're good. My world is much bigger than I thought. Rather, my world was much too small. From my point of view, the world is so brilliant. When I'm with you, I discover so many new things about myself. Laughter, anxiety, it's quite an education. I wouldn't like discovering anxiety, I already have enough of that. If only it could go on forever. The answer sounded somewhat sad. Sato. You're with me. What do you think? I enjoy myself. See, glad to hear that. Suru is smiling. This day spent with you will no doubt be treasured. Keep them near to my heart. I feel a sense of affection from Mitsuru. I wonder when they're gonna say the world's gonna end next. You never know. Remember Y2K? I don't, I was like a baby. <laughs> I don't, I don't remember that. People thought like the computers were gonna break or something because they would all change to 2000 <laughs> or something ridiculous like that. I was barely, I, I was barely old enough to even understand what was happening. I was still like a child. Return to the dormitory, Junpei greeted you like he was waiting for you. Oh, there you are. Hi, here I am. We're all going to uh, Hagakure. Wanna come? Oh, sure. <laughs> I'm not paying your way. <laughs> nah, I wasn't <laughs> expecting you to. Akihiko-san's buying. Him and me had a little bet in Yakushima. Oh. I can't really go into details, but in the end... I guess you're the one who actually won. A bet? Oh, did it have to do with the whole hot spring situation? Because, yeah, of course I won because I found you fuckers <laughs> trying to peep at the hot springs. <laughs> you didn't even know you were part of it. Well, I don't look a gift horse in the mouth, you know? Anyways, I've just been waiting for you to get back. Everyone else already left, so we got a jet. Let's go! You want Todai Strip Mall, Hagakure Ramen. Akihiko, I guess, and Yukari are already sitting there. Can I guess even. Special okay for <laughs> can I guess even eat ramen? Sounds good. Okay. Five specials, please. Fuck, I want ramen now. Awesome. Akihiko san's never treated us all to ramen before. <laughs> hey, why do I have to treat everyone? <laughs> That was only with Junpei. <laughs> Not this again. <laughs> Come on, Akihiko-san. A bet's a bet. Pay up. All right, all right. I never said I wouldn't. What's wrong, I guess? You doubting me too? No, but... Have you seen the magazine on that counter? Oh no, it's not about the cults again, is it? There's an article in it that looks highly disturbing. Oh. Which magazine? It's this one. Emergence of a Messiah. The charismatic one speaks. 
I guess brought over the magazine and handed it to Akihiko. Well, it must be about that doomsday cult. They're all over the internet, too. Bruh. Huh? Hey, look at the photo in this. Check out the so-called messiah. What the? Guess who? I is that Takaya? <laughs> yep! Takaya's indeed gritting provocatively in the article's photo. <laughs> provocatively? What a word choice. I thought something was up. So, Strega's behind that cult. Of course Strega is. <sighs> I've lost my appetite. Disgusted, Akihiko passed the magazine back to Igus. Listen to what he says. Mankind is currently imprisoned by the sins of hate and anger. But soon, a savior will descend upon this world to break the chains that bind us and lift us to new heights. Yep, that sounds like a typical doomsday cult to me. This great being is Nyx. I have beheld her glory, and she has blessed me with power beyond belief. In Nyx, there is no pain, no suffering. How the hell does he know about Nyx? Wait, he's saying that Nyx will save the world? That's not true. I don't think he really means what he's saying. This is all just a game to him. That son of a bitch. Don't worry. We'll get a chance to punch both him and Jin in the face. But there are those who do not understand this truth, even though they have also been blessed by her. They have acquired the same power as I, yet they abuse it, using it for their own personal gain. Uh, excuse you, we're not using it for personal gain. These miscreants are the ones to blame for the recent tragedies that have been plaguing our streets. Wait, is he talking about us? Not so loud. <laughs> yeah! Junpei being like, is this person talking about us? <laughs> In regards to people going missing and stuff? Like, shush! Shush! <laughs> oh, sorry. Hey, what's up with them calling him the charismatic one? How'd he get so popular all of a sudden? Well, Jin's pretty well known on the internet. He's probably pretty good at stirring up trouble. Yeah, I bet he orchestrated Takaya's rise to fame. It doesn't help that Takaya resembles Jesus, either. Ugh, oh, those two make me sick. Brothers and sisters, I shall go forth to make preparations for Nyx's arrival. But do not fear those evildoers who desecrate their gifts. Nyx shall right their wrongs. May your hearts be filled with peace as you await your salvation. Blessed are those who take joy in the coming of Nyx. The revolution is here. Revolution? People can't seriously be buying this crap, can they? Oh, you'd be surprised. Throughout history, those who have changed the future have often been highly charismatic. That's the end of the article. It appears that after the interview, Jin and Takaya disappeared again. I wonder where they disappeared off to. Couldn't possibly be Tartarus, could it? Well, there's only one place they could have gone. Tartarus. They must have been planning this all along. Takaya's words have changed the mood of the entire city. Even though they won't admit it, they are all afraid. Yeah. I mean, why else would people believe this nonsense Takai is preaching? Well, I guess people just need something to believe in. Well, no wonder there's a sense of doom in the air. We're all gonna die. But is that so surprising? The fact that all life ends one day has nothing to do with Nyx. Death is a natural occurrence in the cycle of life. Don't all humans realize this? I guess. Tell you the truth, I never even would have thought about my own death if none of this had happened. But since we've made up our minds, why don't we just leave it at that? <laughs> our objective is Nyx. The 
If Strega gets in our way, we'll just have to deal with them too. And they will get in our way, and we absolutely will have to deal with them. I agree. We'll probably run into them at Tartarus anyways. Yep. However you look at it, we're the obstacle standing in their way. The promised day will soon be here. I say bring it on! <laughs> as fearless as ever. Bring it on! Alright, and if that's the case, we're gonna need lots of energy. Let's eat. <laughs> Excuse me, I'd like to order a Hagakure bowl. Didn't he just have the special? Junpei, don't forget you're having half of Igus's food too. Oh, don't worry. I'm starving. You just better eat it all. <laughs> better eat it all because I'm paying for it. I've seen the screen name Jin before. It's very popular and has a lot of support from his followers. Very charismatic figure. So he's an influencer. You're saying that Jin is an influencer? Somebody cancel Jin, please. I can't believe he's the same Jin as the one from Strega. All somebody has to do is like dig up something on him and then cancel him, right? <laughs> I have to admit, Strega knows how to control the media well. I'm a little disappointed in the media for being so easily controlled by them. It's not that the media is controlled by them, it's just that the media will take whatever makes the most money and run with it. I think the media were paid off by Strega to promote them? Yeah. Actually, that'd be even more disappointing. I mean, that's just how it is. Idiots who are being fooled by the cult better wake up, man. Wake up, sheeple! <laughs> Sorry. I can't fucking help it. They know that Strega's all behind it. Can't they see through all of Strega's negative teachings? I think the magazines that interviewed Strega are ridiculous. They're usually tabloids that would do shit like that anyway. They're acting careless. They think they can write whatever they want as long as it helps sell magazines. That's capitalism! It's true, but it still doesn't make it right. 95% of the people who are referred to as charismatic by the media are fakes. Then, would Strega be considered to be in the remaining 5%? The answer is no. They don't have charisma. They're just agitators who are stirring up unrest in society. I think Strega is controlling people by taking advantage of their insecurities. So, if people have enough confidence, Strega probably can't influence. Well then, we should just ignore their preaching, right? Right. So, no matter what, just don't forget who you are. That's the key. Even if I was in, wasn't in C's, I still wouldn't join the cult. Would you? No. Uh, I don't like cults. Cults are fascinating, but... They're not something I'd ever want to join, but people usually join without knowing that they're joining a cult. Assert my individuality through boxing. There's no room for the cult to come into my life. You seem to have an activity that you assert your individuality through, too. Minako-san, I want to be by your side. This is looking directly into your eyes. Whoa. Hi. Okay. 
Michael Kahn High School, rooftop. I like this place. See the entire town from here. Moonlight Bridge is to the right. Over there is Polonia Mall. Oh, did you know you can also see our dorm from here? Ocean waters at Yakushima, where I had been sleeping, were clearer than the. Oh, wait! Oh, the bet that Junpei was talking about was the the bet to pick up girls at Yakushi at the beach. That's what he was talking about. It wasn't the hot spring. That was Kyoto. Okay. I prefer the view here. Before I came here, things such as liking or disliking the scenery never entered my mind. How about you, Minako-san? Do you like this town? I like it. Glad to hear that. Feeling the same way as we viewed the scenery? Feels nice. Smiling. Any feelings towards various things I had not recognized before are making themselves clear now. A little scary, some. I can change by being with you. I want to hold on to this feeling. I feel strength budding from within, I guess. Oh, sorry to have gone on for so long. It's still January, so I imagine that you are quite cold. It'd be awful if you caught a chill. your day already the middle middle of january today is the 13th i only have 18 more days let's go to tartarus today even though i might be overdoing it i still want to do as much as i can right now it's fine everything will be fine We don't need to go to Tartarus, we just take the dog for a walk. Over here a conversation. I had a flyer at Polonia Mall when I went last time. Same one that's plastered all over the city. One with the Nyx logo? Oh, so that's how it's pronounced. I just like the logo's design. The stuff written here is kind of interesting too. Maybe I should ask them about it next time. Oh boy. It's gonna be all Mitsuru and I guess. Gonna be the rest of the fucking game, it's Suru and I guess. At least as far as social links go. We advance the judgment social link by going through the final block of Tartarus. Every, uh, what, like, 10 levels? No, not 10 levels. Is it every 10 levels or so that we get uh, a rank up in judgment? I can't remember. It's something like that. But that's how judgment will rank up. Alright, let's go back and hang out with Mr. Hi, Jamie! Jamie! Computer issues. Ew. You didn't miss much. We're just talking about cults. You know, no big, no big deal. Or Island Station Movie Theater. Fun time with Mitsuru. Trying to see that movie for a long time. Very entertaining. I thought it was a typical road trip movie. The way the characters expressed their emotions was great. The main character sacrificed everything just to go on a journey with his friends. 
then in the final scene, he decided to return to his normal life. I wonder if he was happy with that decision. Hey, Arisato. You ever thought about going to a place like that? Somewhere far away, where no one knows who you are? Yeah, I have. Really? I'm surprised to hear that. I know you felt that way. Suru's so forcing a smile. Don't misunderstand me. I don't yearn to leave everything behind. It's just that sometimes it's easy to become bound by the things that are important. Future with the company, all my responsibilities. Wish I didn't have so much to worry about. Sometimes I feel shackled by my family name. However, I know that kind of thinking is not permitted. I'm so undisciplined, constantly complaining. I must bore you with all my griping. Some senpai I am. I've been doing nothing but leaning on you. Thru seems to trust you. Oh? What? Interesting. Okay. Made my decision. Yet all I do is complain lane and run from my choice. I talk about responsibility, but in the end, I haven't the courage of my convictions. Am I really this weak? Just a woman waiting for someone to support her? I really do find new facets of myself when I'm with you. I am. Cool. Don't blame yourself. You're right. Stating this won't help anything. Zeru's so forcing a smile. Anako? Would you run away with me? Absolutely! There you are! It's Suru! Looking for you. Didn't expect to find you here. We're leaving. Let's go. Wait a minute. I didn't make any plans with you for today. Well, my business meeting for this evening has been cancelled. Very busy man. You're just going to have to adjust your schedule to mine. I can't. I've already made plans. Well, you can break them. I don't think you have anything more important to do than to spend time with me. Wow. Don't look so sullen. You know this benefits you as well, don't you? Thought you understood our arrangement. This guy looks like a fucking asshole. You're to be my wife, and you are to be obedient. Wow, yep, he's definitely an asshole. <laughs> Must you and your family always be so difficult? At least your father's no longer alive. I'm relieved at that. Wow! Imagine you feel the same. How? How could you say that? Sue's trembling with anger. How fucking dare you, you bitch! Nako. Sue seems happy. This dude is a dick? Absolutely! 110%. Who are you? I think you'd best be quiet. Listen, Mitsuru. Corporate management is not a child's play. No matter how smart you are, you're still going to need my knowledge and experience. The Carijo Group still needs the cooperation of my company, does it not? Yes. Oh, what a fucking bitch. Oh, I made reservations for us at a luxurious restaurant. Well, wish you hadn't seen that. Well, thank you. I had a lot of fun today. And I'm sorry. Please excuse me. Senpai, let's run! Top Arisato. I know how you feel. I... Mitsuru has a sad look on her face. Let's go, Mitsuru. Oh, wait, who are you? never seen you in a fashionable society, so I assume you're a commoner. You do attend the same school. Don't you see the ocean of difference between you and Mitsuru? It's for you too, Mitsuru. Choose your acquaintances carefully. After all, they'll become mine as well. If your friends aren't suited to high society, I'm the one who'll suffer. Bad company ruins good morals, as they say. Don't worry, I've picked out other friends for you. Refined ones. I advise you never come near Mitsuru again, little missy. Oh my god. <laughs> he 
would pro if he if we tried to haul him into the dark hour, he'd probably transmogrify into a coffin. But I mean, just have I guess shoot him, <laughs> or have the dog stab him. Yes, have the have the dog stab him with a knife. It's none of your business. Grasp the trouble you're causing for Mitsuru. Are you simple? You do have a pretty face. Might allow you to sneak your way into high society. Hold on. So that's your scheme? How exciting it must be to use your sex as a weapon. Men, however, require talent. I have the group to look after. Little girl's burdens are nothing next to me. I really, really fucking hate this guy. Oh my god. It's enough. Mitsuru? Said that's enough. Getting so angry. Why are you what the fuck? Why are you asking why she's angry? You're just standing there blatantly insulting me. Why do you think Mitsuru's fucking pissed at you? Insult her, you insult me. Mitsuru? Forgotten? If you cross me, then you spoke of burdens, did you? We're right to do so. Indeed, there's no comparison. She stands on her own feet and fights fate with her own strength. Her outlook on life has redeemed and comforted me innumerable times. She is dear to me. Take back your insults. What? Fine, fine. I suppose you can associate with her from time to time. A feeble apology. Where's the option to punch him? Seriously, I really, really want an option to punch him. People are not things. Not pawns, and they're definitely not your servants. A man who fails to understand that cannot possibly develop the group. After all, a company is made of its people. The Kariju group will not prosper under you. From today forth, you and I are strangers. Our group shall recover. There's no need to plead for help from a shabby cretin like you. If you try to do anything malicious, I will use the power of the group to destroy you. I fucking love Mitsuru. Get out of here, you snob! I don't want to see your face ever again! Uh. Mommy! Mommy! <laughs> ah, the well-dressed man ran away! <laughs> oh. <laughs> Company is made of its people. My father told me that many times. Did he just cry for his mommy? He certainly fucking did! Mitsuru made this grown man cry for his mommy. That's why Mitsuru is amazing. Thanks for coming to my TED talk. <laughs> Family, companies, society, people are the basis of everything. I think I now fully grasp the meaning behind his words. Let's go home. I to return to the dorm. Hi, how was your day? Oh, you know, insulting a grown man. <laughs> That's what we did today. Oh, that was great. Okay. Well, we didn't get a chance to punch him, but Mitsuru insulted the fuck out of him. Which I think is just... which is just as good. <laughs> Punching my manager? <laughs> we can't- we can do that too, if you want. Up. Oh, here we go. Two people wandering around Tartarus. Okay. I see you, Jamie. Have a good lunch. Oh, is Jugi streaming? We'll have to raid him then. Yes. Love you too, Jamie.
Jogi. He finally got affiliate, didn't he? Everyone should sub to Jogi. Finally on September 24th, that's when my rebellion ended. This marked the end of the war, end of the age of the samurai. I'm going to skip the next chapter and go back to the Sengoku era. There's much more to cover. Huh? Modern history? You guys are still juniors. You have plenty of time to learn modern history when you're seniors. People talk about the end of the world. Don't worry, there'll still be another school year. <laughs> wow, well, don't worry, there'll still be another year of school. Don't worry about the end of the world. We'll still have to go to school, even if the end of the world happens. Come on, haven't you paid attention? Look how long this country has survived so far. Anyways, let's start with the Kamakura era. How did the Kamakura Shogunate come about? Well, I'll tell ya. Okay. Okay, with that, I am going to end up for today. And we're gonna raid Jogi, who finally hit affiliates. Very happy for him. Um, anyway, just a quick thing. I'm not going to stream tomorrow or Sunday. There's a charity event going on. I'll put the drop. The, I've, uh, uh, I retweeted some stuff from them, and I'm going to drop the link in the Discord for them, too. I want to support the charity stream that's happening this weekend. I know I'm going to be donating like I do every year. And you guys should check them out, the, the Vine Sauce team. They're a really good group of people. Very nice and very chill. Have just generally fun to watch, and I love them all a lot. Um, so you guys have a good weekend. Take care of yourselves. Drop by the charity stream and at least watch if you can. Donate if you want. You know, support them if you can. And I'll see you guys next week. Okay, next uh um Monday. Yeah. You guys, Monday. Bye bye. Oh, wait. Yeah, let's go raid Joogie. <laughs> bye bye. Bye bye. Have a good one, guys. Go support Joogie.